Good afternoon. Genetic Analysis released a press release this morning stating that they have entered an agreement with Thales Medical Technology Group to develop diagnostic solutions for the human microbiota market in China. With me on link to talk more about this, I have Anita patel Snes, Chief Commercial Officer at Genetic Analysis. Welcome, Anita. Thank you. So you have now entered a laboratory development test agreement with Thales. Can you please tell us a bit more about the details of the agreement? Sure. So today we announced that the genetic analysis and the Thales Medical Technology Group has entered a lab developed test agreement for the Chinese market. And this agreement is to evaluate and develop uh, innovative diagnostic solutions for the rapidly growing human microbiota market in China. Uh, Thales was, will use its Shanghai-based medical lab group to do this, and uh, we're thrilled that uh, we are a part of this. And in the first stage of this agreement, Thales Group will will uh, do their uh, research and, and development from the Shanghai-based independent lab called Thales Med Lab. And who are Thales? Thales is a medical technology group and corporation from China um, with a, a long history in China and is an enterprise that is uh, is big. It's established uh, all the way back in 1998 and has a, a public um, uh, has uh, is on the public market as a stock exchange since 2016. Um, Thales has. Uh, aspired to be the most innovative trusted partner in China, uh, building the expertise within the IVD uh, diagnostic solutions business. And uh, they are covering more than 30 provinces, more than three, 2,000 cities, thousands of hospitals and labs. So you can just imagine uh, in China how big it is. And they have you know, been growing strongly uh, in average 30% year by year as a company and has a turnover in 2020. They had a turnover around 1 billion uh, Norwegian kroners. So um, it is a big company and a solid partner for innovative diagnostic solutions. A uh, big player then, but what can you say about the market potential for you in uh, China? So the market potential in China is is big, as you can imagine. Over the recent years, the Chinese human microbiome ma market is being, you know, harnessed and, and developed and, and uh, grown through the the, the rising incidence of, of chronic diseases like diabetes and an aging population, and also the, the continuous search and research in China uh, for pharmaceutical solutions in both pharma industry and academia. So the, the market, um, I would say, the, the global market is expected to grow at a 22%, and, and many, many say that uh, the whole human microbiome market will by 2029 be as big as $1 billion. And most of this growth will be run or driven by US and the Chinese market. So to 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 say that the Chinese market is going to be instrumental in the future for the growth, for sure. And it's a rapidly growing market, we know globally. And the overall incidence of gut diseases like IBS and, and IBD is also uh, known in China. like. IBS is expected to have a prevalence up to 11.5%. And this is actually, some experts say that this is underestimated. So you can just imagine how big of a population in China with IBS. Uh, and our test is approaching this IBS segment. And in addition, we have the IBD, uh, the more serious inflammatory gastro um, bowel diseases. And here we have an estimate of 1.5 million Chinese uh, patients by 2025. So it is a big potential in China for the microbiome market. Can you tell the viewers a bit more about your uh, GA platform, the product? The GA, yeah, sure. So. Last year, uh, Genetic Analysis uh, launched the updated version of the GMAP dysbiosis test, which is the first CE-marked um, IVD test providing microbiota profile and dysbiosis status in IBS and IBD patients. So GMAP technology is in, is in itself based on a very innovative, predetermined, targeted approach. This means that uh, the 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 bacteria that we want to look for are already defined in a panel. So the predetermined target approach gives us an opportunity to 
simultaneously analyze a large number of bacteria, and uh, we're very um, happy to say that our cutting edge software algorithm is also part of the GA, GA map platform. So this enables the laboratory to do clinical uh, clinical testing of microbiome on a faster speed and uh, on a lower cost as well, we assume. And what does this um, agreement now mean for your company moving forward, Anita? Oh, we're super excited, as you can tell. Uh, the agreement uh, gives us a lot of new uh, opportunities. Um, it is uh, because Thales is such a solid company, they have a global uh, footprint in the in the research diagnostics. And, um, and they uh, will, together with us, uh, supply um, us with expertise, with customer distribution channels, and uh, we will be a part of this fast-growing Chinese market uh, moving forward. So also is a key objective for GA as a company to have a geographic expansion, and, and this will enable us to, to move into Asia. And, and we are super excited that this is aligned with our objectives and what we said in the IPO. So it's a major milestone that has been achieved in the GA uh, company's history actually today. Well, congratulations, Anita, and thank you very much for joining me today. Thank you so much for having us.